If I'm an institutional investor who has billions of dollars that I'm managing for other people, I wanna have a portfolio that has non-correlated assets, meaning they don't all move in the same direction with each other. So that way I can diversify my risk across all the other assets. It's kind of like a teeter-totter effect, right? It's one of the classic pieces of investing advice you get in the beginning, which is to own some stocks and some bonds. Because when stocks go up, bonds go down, and when bonds go up, stocks go down. So your risk is diversified. But since Bitcoin fell and the stock market fell, it reaffirms to those guys, at least for now, that Bitcoin is a very correlated risk on asset. And if I'm a hedge fund investor, I might wanna hold off on buying Bitcoin until I see that they don't move in the exact same direction to each other.